Donald Trump was already having an awful day and his biggest nightmare may be coming true because it's just been announced that the Department of Justice has demanded that Trump tax returns be given to Congress. This is devastating for Trump. Now, we all know that Cy Vance in Manhattan, in New York, already has Trump's tax returns and he fought tooth and nail to have his tax returns hidden and he failed there. But so far, there hasn't been public scrutiny by the government, by Congress, into Trump's taxes and all the potential lies and criminalities and fraud within those documents. And remember, Donald Trump promised that he would release his tax returns all the way back in 2015, 2016, and he never did, unlike all the other major people who have run for president, at least in modern American history. And this is devastating for Trump for so many reasons. One, this could lead to a public forensic analysis of his documents, of his taxes, which could reveal all sorts of additional crimes and embarrassments of the former president. Cy Vance is looking at it right now, but again, the reason that those documents aren't quite as damaging in Vance's hands is that they can't be made public. Vance can use them. He can look for crimes in those documents, crimes of Trump and his organization, maybe his family, his business partners, etc. But he can't put those in the newspaper. He can't put those in the news. He can only show those to the grand jury and to other witnesses and etc. So now that Congress has them, they can, after looking at the documents, they can't just publish them willy nilly, file a public public report with all the details in it, forensically outlining Trump did crimes, Trump lied about how rich he is, either he inflated his wealth to look like a big shot or he deflated his wealth to dodge taxes. And there's a real chance that these public investigations into his documents could lead to a snowball of civil and criminal charges against him. Because Cy Vance is only looking at one narrow slice just for New York, what about other crimes in other jurisdictions? What about other embarrassments in other jurisdictions? What if in the course of this investigation, they find that Trump committed tax fraud somewhere else? What if in the course of the investigation, they found that Trump lied about every kind of major thing about his, his identity? This could sink him. So this is an optics issue. This is a politics issue, this is a civil legal issue, and this is a criminal legal issue. And Trump has fought this for years. Again, the only reason Trump has been fighting this, he's been fighting this for at least three or four years now, is because he knows he's hiding something. We all know that, right? Let's, like, let's be real. Let's all be adults here. Trump knows that in those documents are thousands of lies and crimes and distortions and grifts, and schemes, and scams, and frauds. We know that. So Donald Trump realizes that these documents, in the hands of the public, in the hands of Congress, could destroy him. Without hyperbole, this is Trump's biggest nightmare, and could ruin his life more than any other investigation. And I am here for it. We want to see just how big of a crook he is. Let's look at his taxes.